Warning, the following game is rated mature and contains content not suitable for younger viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. On the last episode, we're still going around Elodin because we can't get these stupid tasks done. Uh, although we did make some decent progress, although it took us once again forever. Uh, we did head over to the other tasks uh, to go see what they were doing. Uh, we went all the way up to the northeastern part where there was another vault there, dove into it, and took care of all of the, uh, all of the, uh, outcasts that were there. So, yay, we got the, we got the data at the end of the hallway. We also headed over to the crashed Ket ship, only to find a couple of Ket were shooting at each other. Apparently the Ket don't even like each other now, so... We grabbed a data disk that was just there, and it's apparently the hardest thing that Sam has ever seen to hack, so you gotta bring it onto the Tempest. We finally started finding the tasks, though. Uh, first with the the body that we had to find and find out why they were all poisoned, and it turns out there's some tainted meat, uh, but we gotta go and find out what's going on with that. And we finally found the data pads for Little Mouse, and that leads us over to another place. So... Let's wrap a bell in now. <laughs> we have we have only a couple things left. We have to follow the nap point for this. This one I think will be actually this will be the easiest. Uh we have volatile and then we have little mouse. And then we have Oh god, it's so bright. Then we have oh, where is it? Oh, I fell. Where is it? I should be on the correct... This should be the correct, uh... The correct sinkhole. Maybe I already passed it. I can't wait to fall in the dirt. Is this the correct sinkhole? Oh, not even... Not even close. <laughs> yeah, there's something over there. Uh, let's start off by going... Over here. Get this one done now. Because this one should be like, we just, I think if I remember correctly, we drive up to it and we, we end the mission. It's that simple. The explosive one might take a little bit longer. Just because there's a, probably going to be like a base you have to go blow up. And then the little mouse one, I have no recollection on how that ends up. So we'll just have to wait and see. And then there's the there's the auxiliary vault that we get to go through. I don't know. I don't remember how big it is. I don't remember what the layout is. All I remember is that there's just another vault here. That is 100% optional. I'm so glad I was able to fit through that. Okay, we have a we have a radar thing. Pathfinder, I detect radiation in these creatures. It may be the source of the disease. They have to be getting it from somewhere. Let's look around. All right, let's follow the let's follow the source. Oh God, the source is following me. Uh, the, the source has completely vanished. Uh... Oh, hello there. I'm going to be honest. I completely thought... I thought it was over here, but I guess it's like around here somewhere. Pathfinder, I detect a high concentration of radiation from these canisters. I have adjusted your Omni tool to nullify the radioactive material. Cool. All right, let's nullify this then. What an easy way to take care of radiation. Just hack it. <laughs> hack the radiation away. Ow. Pathfinder, the radiation source appears to be properly contained. Carriers have been eliminated. Then we stop the disease from spreading? 
It will not reach colony residents. I will relay our danger to the Nexus so they can take preventative measures. Cool. Why did every echidna have to ta attack me at the same time? <laughs> I don't recall if those those containers are there uh, the last time we were here when we had to do the like did they spawn in once we found all of the correct all the tainted meat bodies probably why is that marked over there uh, let's go for this one little mouse's stash I'm actually I actually just want to drive over there because I feel like this might be a a somewhat short episode compared to the previous couple. Just because there's uh, nothing more to do on Elodin after this. Once again, barring any quests that come here in the future. Although we are getting real close to the end. <laughs> like, what do we have after this? Where's my spreadsheet at? Let's see. According to this, my spreadsheet for this, we're already at like 90%. In game, we're at 79%. But. If we're at 90%, there's only a couple things left to do. And most of it is story related. And we have to go to Meridian. There's, I think, one or two story missions after that. So we're catching. We're almost at the end. We got the one task where we have to talk with the with the uh, reporter that found herself in jail. And uh, I think one or two missions that start after the next story mission. Get ready to fight. I forgot I was sniping. We're going to get this bleep bloop today. Gravity goes away in three. Ooh, that must have hurt. Okay, this is a little mouse's stash, or is this the main guy's stash? I wasn't even close. What are they fighting? Oh. Have I scanned an agent before? Under heavy fire. Sure have. Oh, you poor man. Whiffed it. That's it. Good work. Ooh, this must have been Little Mouse, huh? Must be the scavenger who wrote those data pads. Didn't get far, did he? Well, finders keepers, right? Ooh. Thank you for that. That wasn't Little Mouse. Little Mouse is out there somewhere. We'll never see him. I don't think we ever see him. The heck is over here? No, 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 no. Story. Not story. Mission. Oh, I could start checking these off. We're finally getting them done. Cash flow. I infection. Little Mouse. The next spot we're heading off to is where the uh, the explosives are at. How many times did we level up last episode? Once? I think we're close to the... Eh, we're about halfway. To be fair, that's only like 10 big fights. We get like the full 499 experience per fight. Ooh, speaking of which, I did manage to get my uh my profiles leveled up. So now I have max vanguard. Yay! Uh infiltrator is also maxed. Explorer is also maxed. Sentinel is also maxed, which just leaves all of the base ones. Uh four, four, and four. Oh god, my throat. Uh <coughs> What the heck happened there? Ugh. My throat just became immediately dry like a desert. Oh. <laughs> 156 skill points just to get to level 5. 
we have one twenty, one twenty one, one twenty four. So yeah, we're we're like God, that's what? Thirty each? So that's ninety points. Which is, uh, like, 15 levels. <laughs> Just to get to level 5 for all of them. So we're at, what, 66? 8, 91. We'll be, we'll be able to have level 5 rank stuff. Beyond that... Whatever, however many we need for level 6? I'm, I'm going to assume 199 of each. Our teammates are already maxed out. The only one that has points left is, uh, is, uh, Ryder. Does it lead here? Isn't this what? Didn't we already, weren't we already here? Oh, they're trying to leave. The scavengers have stockpiled explosives. We can't let them get a chance to use this. We need to take it out. Roger. That was easy. <laughs> that was kind of fun. I no longer detect a signal, Pathfinder. I believe we have eliminated the source. Good. We're done here. Hey, is that guy still in here? The one we bought that thing for? No? Okay, that's a shame. Ooh, that poor computer. That screen is demolished. PB, get out of the way. There we go. Oh, they're both there. Oh, that guy's gone. Probably dead. Poor him. He was actually kind of nice to us. Other than that, though, that is everything on Illidan. Except for the... Except for the caches. Except for the caches. I gotta just mark that down as complete, even though I can't get it. Uh, yeah. So what does that put our percentage at now? Uh, it puts us at... It gave us a full 2%. Okay. What does that put us at here? Autosave. That's still at 8, 79%. I still feel like I have to actually scan the planets. In the solar system, in the in the in the galaxy map. All right then. Oh boy, <laughs> that's a pit I will not be able to uh, not be able to turbo out of. Well then, I think we're ready to go over to the hidden vault, the auxiliary vault, the optional vault, whatever you call it. I'm so glad. I'm so glad we got all the missions done. Heck, with that, I think that's every task. Well, no, just the Path of the Hero one, but... That is every task. All we have left now are, like, side missions and... Squad missions and main missions. What do you have in this list? Truth and Trespass, we have to go to Vold. That one, we have to go back to the Tempest. We might be getting that at the end of this episode. Just that. Everything else is completed in a random order of things. That I wish could be sorted, because it make it make checking everything so much simpler. And heck, this checklist counts, like, all of the romance options that we can't do. Since, you know, there's like seven or eight or nine people that can be romanced, and we can only choose one of them. Well, we could have chose more than one of them, but we didn't because we're, we're monogamous. <laughs> Let's see what's inside this vault. Mustn't be that important if we can just skip it outright.
right, nothing's attacking us immediately. That's a good sign. Do have to check everywhere just to be on the safe side. Don't I don't like the blue dots. What are the blue dots? And what do we have to worry about here? Okay, we got friendly remnants. Potentially friendly remnants. The waist high walls and the explosives don't bode well. Hello there. Never mind, it's gone. Wow, they both just demolished that. Stay alert. There'll be more. And nullifiers up ahead. Haven't noticed us yet, but as soon as I shoot, well, I guess someone already shot. Quick as weak spot. I don't know if that counted as a hit. Well, this is lucky. <laughs> They're not shooting back at me. What is a turret? Ow! Oh. It'll affect their shield too. Hold on. Is there nothing that I can turn off for them? Doesn't look like they have a turn off thing. Not cool. the weak point on a turret maybe just the whole thing okay it's not the big glowy orange spot My punches are doing more than sniper round shots. That has a door at the end. That also has a door at the end. That has a door at the end. Okay. You have a choice. Is there a map? There's not a map. Ah, there's something down there. Hold on, let's grab this first. I was just about to ask. It seemed like it was too barren. Oh, not that far. So here's another one of those data cores. This is the 10th of 11. The remnant builders really love their boxes, huh? I thought you wanted these. I know we have 10 because we got the blee blue for having nine. So there's only one left and it's part of the story. So yay, we're done with those. Is this negatively affecting my shield? I assume yes, because of the red line. The platform's going up.
Looks like there's a trick to this interface. Let's figure it out. Okay. <laughs> They're all down. That's not correct. Hmm. Maybe I turn on... Let's see. I think that was correct. That activates something way over there. Nice. What do we get? I don't know. Oh boy. Well, now I have to know. What the heck is up here, game? There is a cache on the map. Oh, well, that sucks. We gotta check up... Uh, we have to check up there. We gotta check over at the other spots. Oh, that was barely... A, that was barely a thing. There's a big... There's a big container there. Okay. Why? <laughs> Why are you not grabbing now? Well, I'm stubborn, so we're doing this until we get that container. Even if I fail all my jumps somehow. I might not need to dash, but boy, it's sort of not helping. There we go. Okay. That one needs the dash. That was it? Just two things? Okay. And there's nothing down there. So this line is leading me back to the center. No, it's leading me over to the... The heck was that? Oh. A lot of immediate baddies. Low ammo. Oh, there's like seven more than I thought. No ammo. Well, that worked. That signal's still coming through. I saw this. Not close enough. I'm not close enough. There we go. That should do it. I guess it was just those two. We still have seven. That's definitely more than enough. I never have to use my brain again. Got it. So yeah, if we if we wouldn't have gotten the bleep bloop last episode, we would have probably gotten it there. Oh, there's a big, there's a big boy over there. 
Oh, this goes south. Someone's very angry. I can hear they're fighting all the way over here. The heck are they shooting? I mean, this thing is just grinding out these these weak points for me. <gasps> Red 94. There we go. I just watch it unlock. Okay, I've missed. Have you been alerted to my presence yet? None of those hit. Ammo. Ow! Okay, yeah, there's the bleep bloop. I don't know if it's worth using a... It's worth using a Kerbal RPG thing on you. Oh, I can't launch to myself at that? I'll die. Still doesn't explain why I was just shooting the wall. I shot the wall a lot. <laughs> That's where we got the uh, data core thing. I think everything in here is done. I don't think there was like a big mystery to solve. It was just the uh, the data core, the thing that led me over there to that cache, and then that unlocking a giant boss over there. <laughs> and we got a bleep bloop! Yay! So what does that leave us with? And uh, eh, <laughs> We'll find out how to do that long jump eventually. Be more. There aren't more. They're all dead. Ryder, come on. <laughs> Unless I'm mistaken. Please let me be mistaken. I deserve it. Ah, oh, we're not we're not that lucky. Okay, well, that does it for Elodin. Let's go around gra gathering all the caches, which we'll probably wait until we're, uh, we have level 10 stuff unlocked, which will require us to be level 80. Uh, we're done here. There's nothing left. We have all the missions done. Yay. So let's get off of here and let's go see what's happening on the Tempest. Anyone need to talk? No one needs to talk. Oh, we need to talk to Subi, though. It's almost unbelievable that some of the Ket would be fighting their own. The Ket always seems so monolithic, almost faceless. 
I wish we saw more of that fighting. Wouldn't shed a tear if they wiped themselves out. Whatever they've done, they're still a unique, fascinating species. It's hard for me to wish them all dead. Anyway, about this kit device you found by their destroyed ship, it's secured with a biometric lock that can only be activated with a specific genetic code. So, like a fingerprint scan, except with a genetic fingerprint. Exactly. Whatever's in this, it's probably only meant for trusted individuals. So you're saying I have to track down some ket? But that would be impossible, Ryder. Remember those ket genetic samples you scanned on Vault? Lexi's been working on the data, and I have an idea that just might work. We should go talk with her when you have time. What is Lexi gonna do? You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. I do now, don't I? Can I please do it on the ladder? I'm curious what Lexi's planning. Hello, Lexi. Got your memo, Suvi. Data's right here, but I'm not sure what you're expecting to find. Tell me you have it all sequenced. Yes, of course. It was the first thing I... Perfect. Sam, can you test combinations of sequences against the lock? Testing. Brute force, Dr. Anwar? Tried and true methods. And with Sam's processing speed, it should take no time at... Key found. Whoa. We thought it was a data log, but, it, but it's not. It's... It's... Uh... It just locked onto a transmission. Oh crap, turn it off! Who knows what it's doing? The device is a receiver. It will not reveal our location. This transmission is audio. The Archon has abandoned our way. Spurn's tradition defies protocol. He abuses his authority, obsesses over remnant secrets, and keeps us cut off from home. This cannot continue. He will return to the path of right or be destroyed. This is my promise. An Archon stands tall only while we hold him up. Someone's really upset at the Archon. A collectivist culture would take a harsh view of any action that defied the will of the group. And isolating the Ket here would breed resentment. They may feel... abandoned. Ket? Feeling abandoned? Some things are universal. I, I wonder if there's a way to trace the signal. Scanning for nav point. I'll transmit it to your Omni tool, in case you want to check it out. What do you think we'll find out there? I don't know. It might be a base of Ket dissidents organizing against the Archon. Whatever it is, please be careful, Ryder. It goes to Eos. Well, okay, we gotta go back to Eos now. Oh, teleporting car. It sounds interesting, but I just don't have time for reading fiction. Make time. I'll set you an appointment if I have to. Besides, if you skip the food descriptions, the first volume's only a hundred pages. There's a fiction book about food? What book are they talking about? hundred pages? That's not bad. Oh, whoa, whoa. AVP. Let's go put this in something. Out of the way, Drac. Okay, we have everything in commerce, so we don't need to worry about this. We have everything in... Well, we don't have everything in military. But I don't think we need organic or tech materials given to us. Uh, so that just leaves a bunch of science stuff. We have mining operations and accelerated research. I don't think this will matter. set of minerals yeah mining operations unlocks three things it unlocks all of these three so let's just choose this like I mentioned before I think I only get one more choice <laughs> so it'll probably be No, it'll probably be this then. Ooh, rare mining nodes have been nice. I mean, we're not going to be mining anything. We have yet to actually... We've yet to mine a thing. 
You haven't mined a single thing yet. What are my strike teams doing? All five of them. Oh god, what does this mean? Oh, you failures! It was their first mission. Still glad no one has any negative traits. That's a good sign. Ooh! Oh, I just spent all my points getting a new team, and now I can give you the, the now I can give you the uh, exceptional human intelligence. I know I probably could choose something else like any of these, which are more effectiveness, but they're just they're two specific things. So, I like the all round ones though. All right, well, we don't have much left to do. So next episode, we're probably going to be heading off to Eos, then heading off to Vold uh, to get those uh, other missions done. These two. We need to go to Vold for that. We need to go to Eos for that. Then we that won't go until the next thing we get is... I don't know if that unlocks after the next story mission or the the... Story mission after that. But this is like. This is the. What's the word? Penultimate. <laughs> Penultimate story mission. After it is the point of no return. So we got to worry about that a little bit. So yeah, I think we'll do. Go to those planets. We might spend an episode scanning the planets in, like, the system so that we can get that percentage increased. Because if, if we're still at 79, I'm going to be upset. <laughs> After everything we did, those tasks did nothing. We've been at 79 for days now. Yeah, we got to scan those planets on the galaxy map. Get the galaxy map to very close to 90%. So... Yeah, next episode, Eos and Vold. Told you we weren't done. Uh, we have missions going to both of them. So, until next time, hopefully you enjoy. Mm -hmm.